What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Dermy Wormy, and I'm coming at you with another video, and we're talking the American Society of Magical Negroes. I'm being very careful there because I still don't know what the correct uh the the the, the correct rules are here because hey it's the actual name of the movie and stuff but that's besides the point this is a movie that has been panned by uh everybody all around us okay this is a movie that has been made fun of out outright uh, like being told that hey it's racist by even the root they the, you have the root coming out saying it's racist which is a social justice uh website in and of itself you have mashable saying that it's racist which is another social justice website in and of itself so two websites that uh, should be on your side are already coming out against it you have people left right and center saying how this is such a horrific looking movie nobody is really excited for it it looks downright awful to boot well now you get the creator actually coming out saying uh, a creator or one of the main actors uh, i think it's the main actor himself justice smith coming out and says keep my title out your white uh, mouth say american society that's right uh, he outright came out and said it but to tmz here where he verbatim says Hey, white people, you guys have to rename it and call it the American Society. And don't just take my word for it. Why don't we actually hear it from the horse's mouth, shall we? Justice, how are you, mate? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. Hey, I'm really looking forward to your upcoming film. Oh, thanks. I'm not even... You know, here's the TMZ guy, you know, obviously coming up to him, asking him, like, all this stuff, everything like that. You know, this is how this stuff goes. Sure, if I can say the title. Am I allowed to say the title? Um, <laughs> you know. <laughs> we'll shorten it to American Society. Amer American Society. Oh, oh, white people need to shorten the title? <laughs> white people need to shorten I like that. I like that. Can you? Now, okay, he is obviously laughing. He's he's coming out here. He's laughing the whole time, saying, "Hey, you know, it, it's not why people. You guys need to sh you need to uh, you guys can't say it. You guys have to shorten it to the American Society and everything like that." Uh, he is obviously laughing. He's kind of clowning it up. Might be a joke, but the, here's the reality of this whole movie: is it panders and just craps on white people all around while simultaneously playing into a trope that is overtly there that uh, a lot of people aren't too fond of even within the black community that's why i showed you the uh the root and the um, and uh mashable's whole thing this is a movie built solely around race this is to make no this is not meant for anybody nobody is actually looking forward to this people are coming out the woodworks constantly to say how much they are not into this movie and yet now you got ju <coughs> freaking justice smith coming out here saying hey white people you guys can't well you guys can't say the movie okay you guys you guys have to keep the title out your mouth and everything like that okay you you have to shorten it to american society and i get it okay you got even pink villa over here which is obviously some weird website that i've never known saying hey guys he's joking about it he's joking there's other outlets that are saying hey he's just joking don't take it personally don't take it seriously but how can you not take it seriously when the movie itself and i'm trying to get to the actual uh scene in which they blatantly show white tears oh and they say white people are the most dangerous society to the to the world oh but hey it keeps getting better guys can you, can you please just quickly explain the basic premise to me because it's hilarious uh it's about this guy who um makes a lot of space for white people uh is very uncomfortable around them and he gets indoctrinated into a society whose mission it is to keep white people uh happy yeah oh huh Wow, so even in his breakdown, it's all about race. It's all about the fact that, hey, he doesn't like white people. He feels very uncomfortable around white people. You know, he gets inducted into a society that's all about keeping white people happy so that they're safe. You know, he's not even talking about the fact that the movie was originally portrayed as a rom-com. It is a rom-com on top of that. So it's no longer a rom-com. Even the director, uh, not director, even the uh, main character, the main guy is coming out here saying, oh, it's all about race, guys. Legitimately, it's all about race. But let's continue. And I will play it a little bit more. I don't remember what happens after this, but I think we're pretty much done. But let's just finish this up. Yeah. In order to keep the world safe. Because oh, when yeah. white people are not happy, they do crazy things. <laughs> Facts, bro. Yeah. 
oh, huh, facts. Uh, if white people aren't ha uh, aren't happy, they do crazy things. Oh yeah, we're just trying to you know please the white guy. It's always about race. Everything revolving around this movie is solely race based, and it's disgusting up the wazoo. Again, when this movie was first told to us, shown to us, it looked like a funny time. It looked kind of hilarious you know he had that that little teaser and then we saw the actual trailer and we were disgusted by it i am i i don't know what else to say all i know is the uh, the main character looks super freaking racist and also the main uh the main star looks super freaking racist from all this but hey keep keep the title out your mouth that's what he says I'll leave it there, guys. Let me get your guys' uh, opinion on this down in the comments below. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up, share it out, friends. Hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell for every time I put out a new video and go live, guys. And I'll see you all on the next one. Bye for now.